Damn it. I told you. I already told you it wasn't me, man. Man, come on. I told you like like 20 times. I don't even I don't even know you. Bro. Clear up soon? What am I, the traffic man? I'm supposed to have been at the pen an hour ago. I'm gonna get written up. You're gonna be this annoying no, for the relax. next two hours? It's not your get fault. Get used to it. What the hell, man? What? You know. Cut it out. Jesus, you guys. You gonna make me? Yeah. Hey, Vince! Justin's gonna make me! Too hot for this shit. Vince, I'm making him hot now. Oh, shit! Come on, Vince. Hey, man. How about you open a fucking window? It's a prison bus, asshole. The window. Hey, don't Justin. Open. See that right, guy man. in the beat up that truck? Ain't right. I'll bet he Shut lives in that there. truck now. You probably got his whole house. Life savings. Shit. I bet you stole his dog. You steal his dog, man? I wasn't stealing from guys like that. Anyway, better than stealing his virginity. Hey, how many times I gotta tell you? Here we go. Seriously, I was falsely accused. How old was she, 15? Damn it, it ain't like that. You were convicted, Danny. You gotta admit that much. Oh, come on, Vince. That don't mean I did it. My lawyer's gonna be hearing tell about this. Tell you what, this. guys. I ain't afraid to say it. When he I'm hears about really this. missing my girlfriend right now. I'm oh, guessing she's pretty pissed nerve, at you. Man. It's I worse than that, man. She won't talk to me. Mouth. Haven't heard her voice in months. Really messing with me, like for real. Just let it go, man. I want to, but you know. I love her, man. What's it matter, man? You're headed to jail. Never heard of a conjugal visit? Danny, I know you don't realize this because you're you. But you probably ruined that poor girl's life, you piece of shit. Big talk from White Collar back there. How many lives you wrecked, kid? Who cares? How did they dehydrating? Hey, how about some water back here? Shut I thought you took the there. stand to cry your eyes out. I'm telling you again. Didn't you lose your yeah, shit and tell them you didn't know what you were up, doing? Or I'll set you I up. lied. Turns out I'm good at that. You lied on the stand? See, that's the kind of shit I could never do. Religious? No, man. Watch a lot of cop shows? Nope. You should have been a man about it. I can't believe I'm getting my moralistic shit kicked in by a couple of criminals. You wanna know the funny thing? I don't regret any of it. I carried my victims for years. They knew what they were getting into. And now here I am, and there they are. And Wall Street assholes pulling the same scores are smiling on TV. Fuck that. How did it all work, anyway? It was like, uh... A pyramid scheme. Fuck Wall Street. Fuck Wall Street. Fuck Wall Street. How much did you make off with, anyway? Enough. So, like, a couple hundred K? A little over a hundred. Million. God damn, boy! Oh, ho When we get out of here, you, me, and Vince, we gotta go into business, know what I'm saying? You know, I don't actually know a thing about you, Vince. Maybe he's a priest. Yeah, Father Vincent. I bet he touched a kid. Two kids? You touch a couple kids, Vince? I helped my little brother. They send you to prison for that now? He was in trouble. I had to help him out. I knew it was something stupid. You regret it, man? If you're saying what I think you are, I got respect for you, man. Every day. 
But what are you gonna do? Yeah, I feel you. How'd they get you? Tossed the gun up on a roof. And? It was a good throw, and a roofer found it the next day. You gotta be kidding me. Man, you're bad luck, Vince. Bad luck, Vince! <laughs> That's not bad. What do you think, Justin? What the fuck are you gonna do about fuck it? you! Fuck me? <laughs> fuck you, motherfucker! Oh, shit! Oh, man. Christ. What the hell is going on? Grab tree, here? knock it off! Hey, get in there, man! Hey, let him go, man! Damn it, Crab Tree! Don't make me come back He's there now! He's gonna kill him, Vince! Let the guard handle it, guys. Fuck that! We gotta get in there! You do not want to get in the middle of that shit, Danny. Vince, we gotta do something. You know this ain't right. I'm not doing any more time to save some stupid ass. Help him, Danny! What's that? Speak up, boy. I can't Fucking hear you. Fucking chain's too short! Crabtree, I'm warning you one He's last listening, time, man. Damn it, you gotta boy. get in get there! Get yourself in there and break that shit up now! Come on, boy, get back there! Okay, asshole, let him go! Get in between them, goddammit! He's gonna kill that boy! Crabtree? Last what warning! Do, I do let something! Let him go, goddammit! What the fuck was that? Fuck. Jesus. What happened? What did you do, boy? God damn it, boy! Answer me back there! That guy's there. still alive! Get those cuffs off him, man! What the hell was that? He... he made a move on me! I... I... I don't know! This is crazy. Nobody had to die. This is what happens when you give guns to assholes. He's, uh... Fucking fuck! You gotta call someone, man! What? I'm calling this in. Don't. Don't call it in yet. He might still be alive. Call a damn ambulance, man! I just need a minute! I need a minute to think. You ain't got a minute! Shut up, you hear me? Just shut your mouth! Okay, okay. Calm down. Take it easy. Quit waving that thing around before you get someone else killed! Oh, you gonna get smart with me now? Vince! It's okay. Just back off. We all need to take it down a notch. You really want to pull that trigger again, son? Thanks, man. What the fuck? Did you see that? I saw it. Yeah. Hey, you gotta get us the hell out of here. We're not man. going anywhere! Fuck that! Get this bus moving! Hey, driver! I said let's go, we're man! We're staying right here! We're safe inside the bus! Nothing's gonna. Holy oh, shit! Jesus! Oh my god! Hey! Hey! You need to call someone! You hear me? We need to. Did he just bail on us? Oh, Jesus. What the hell, man? Back up, back up. Fuck! 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 He can't reach us. You sure about that? That ankle's gonna get. Shit. What are we doing, guys? Come on! We gotta do something! I'm trying to think. Find a weapon. What kind of weapon? Where's the guard's gun? Yeah, yeah, the gun. Good thinking, Justin. Where the fuck is it? I think he fell on it. It's underneath it. Oh, fuck me. Get the gun, man! Get up, Vince! Hurry up! Shoot this asshole, Vince! Do it! It, man. Sorry. Sorry. Man, I can't believe this shit. Can you believe this shit, man? No. We gotta find some way to get out of here. How are we gonna get out of here? What are you doing? Can't do anything until we get out of these damn chains. Maybe he's got the keys on him. Nothing. Well, shit, if the keys aren't on him, then where the hell are they? 
He must have left them up front. Maybe we finally caught a break. Danny, Hey, no. buddy! What the fuck? God damn it, Danny. You always put your fucking foot Fuck you, it. man. You gotta get out of here before any more of them show up. That's not gonna hold. Vince! Fire the fucking gun! Whoa, whoa, watch it. Ain't gonna work. I think you just pissed them off. Yeah, yeah, save the shells. Point. How the hell are we gonna get out There's of here? There's gotta be a way. Can't we just shoot off the chains? No way. Wouldn't cut through. What about the cuff? If we shoot one of those off, the chain will slip right out. Are you fucking insane? What do you think is gonna happen if you fire a shotgun that close to someone's Well, foot? what do you think is gonna happen if we don't get the fuck out of here? Vince, give me the gun. We gotta do this. Back off. Vince! What the fuck? Whoa, whoa, whoa! Sorry, bro. No, 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 you can't! Vince, I have a family. Please. Oh! 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 Shit! Still attached. Again! Do it! Oh! 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 Go, let's go! Oh! Ah! Oh god! This is so fucked! Why the hell did you shoot that guy, man? What the hell was that? I didn't mean to do it. It just happened, okay? Where the fuck were you with a warning? Me? You're putting that on me now? I didn't see the guy either. I was too worried those dudes were gonna pull guns on us. Shit! Dude, how'd they catch up to us? Who gives a shit? Just... <laughs> Hurry up, Betty! Here, man. Shoot! Dude, take this... Get him, man! see anything. Are you sure? Those guys wouldn't just give up. I don't see anything. Here, here. I'll turn off. I feel that look on me, man. I'm not being an asshole. I'm being smart. No lights, no... Uh, you know, they can't see us. Christ, I can taste blood in my mouth. I don't think it's mine. Crashing into a cow ain't gonna help anything, Oh, man. shit! I should watch out for cows. Cows! Why didn't I think of that? When's the last time you saw a cow, dude? Okay, bad example, but you could still hit something, man. God, I can't believe we're in this shit. Don't barf just yet, okay? Please, this road is really straight. We'll be fine. At least slow down. What? Fuck no. Did you see that one guy's eyes, man? He's fucking gorked. I don't want that guy in my life, Wyatt. What if there's something in the road? Doesn't matter. We gotta get the fuck away from those guys. They are A-grade fucking mental. It's about time. I will punch your eyes. See? It's fine. Road straight as my dick. 
Think we're in the clear? Don't talk about your dick. Why not? <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's Tom Cruise out of here. Really? See if there's still any sticky in the glove box. I don't see anything. Dude, it's in there. Look harder. I don't see it. What I do see is that ammo that you lost last week. Oh my god, really? But is there any weed? You know, one time I was going out with this girl, right? Abigail. You remember? I don't her? care about she this told me story. That she was five, I think. At her all. dad took her to the circus sideshow. They walked Stop around for a while. Now. Saw the chick with two heads. Saw a dude with lobster hands. Some kind of monkey human with a dick for a face. I don't know. She also said there was a little girl in there the size of an apple. But I called bullshit on that one. The point is, she saw there was this guy standing in there, buck naked, and singing this weird... Are you even listening to me? The guy peed on her dad. Shit! Ah! Holy shit, dude. Holy shit. Did you get a look? I think that was a guy. Wyatt, come on, man, say something. Was that a dude or not? What the... The fucking fog. This night is so fucked, man. It didn't look human. Alive. Whatever. Really? Seriously? I mean, seriously? Look me in the eyes and say that. You heard me, Eddie. Ah! Let's see if there's anything around the car. You know, anything that'll, like, tell us one way or the other. That way we can just book. But I'm not leaving if we hit a human being, man. I'm just not. Man, don't roll it down broken. I can't see through the cracks. Look, it's fine, see? Dude, what's that on the broken side mirror? It's part of a shirt, I think. Yeah, but plenty of dead guys have shirts on. Keep looking. You think that blood on the windshield is fresh or rotten? Does that blood look fresh to you? Yeah, but it's kind of dark. Yeah. Damn. What's that way out in the road? Seriously, you think some piece of that guy made it into the glove box? Man, I don't know. Man, I'm really not seeing anything. Is that the mirror from the car? Can't tell from here. Stop messing around. We need to know what's going on, okay? That's not gonna help. Okay, okay. Jeez. Look. Wyatt. It was a guy. Are you sure? Yes. How sure? Pretty fucking sure. Don't eat a burrito and get on a roller coaster, sure. Jesus. So what do we do? What do you mean, what do we do? We go out there. Go out there and what? Find the guy and help him. Who the hell are you tonight? If it's a guy. It's a guy. I saw him. Come on, man. This is stupid. We go out there, we check it out, we get moving. Give me the gun. Dude, I'm the one who got us into this. I'm the one who hit him. Should be me going. Then why did you ask which one of us should go? Oh, sorry. Next time I get into this exact crazy fucking situation, I'll figure out how I feel before I talk. Okay. Well. Shit. Okay. Here, we'll rock, paper, scissors for it. Are you fucking serious? No. Come on. Sitting here is making me nervous. Man, I can't believe I'm doing this shit. Dude, two seconds, it's over. Alright, two out of three, right? Sure. One, two, three, go. Man. Okay. Alright. One, two, three, go. Ugh. I knew you'd pick rock. You always pick rock, dude. It's stupid. Son of a bitch. All right. I got this. Be careful, dude.
dude. I'll just keep talking to myself out here because that makes sense. Hey man, you okay? Fella? You need to answer me, man. If you're a dude, I don't want to shoot you. Man, I wish I was high right now. Please, just say something, mister. Not sure if you're deaf, dead, or just an asshole, man. <sighs> Shit. Are you okay? Uh, sir? Can you, can you hear me? Damn it, man, are you gonna be alright? Fucking help me out! Man, this guy's a cop. Cop, please be okay. Okay, uh. Sorry, dude. Gotta split.
Hey, Shell, your sister's getting pretty good, huh? Becca had a good teacher, Steph. Thank you for doing that. She needs something to focus on besides, you know, everything else. Yeah. Growing up in a world like this, what do you think that does to a kid? I don't know. I know it's changed me, well, all of us, but at this age, for her, I don't know. Becca's a good kid. These are shit times, and she's gonna go through that. But if we can keep her from experiencing some of the shit I've seen... Thanks, Stephanie. Thanks. Becca, that was great. Thanks, sis. You think we can do something like this every week? If Roman approves it, I don't see why not. Seems like fun. That was amazing, Becca. We could all use a little more music in our lives. Did I ever tell you that I used to play in a band? Yes, Roman, you've told us. She doesn't want to hear about it again. All right, all right. In that case, let's get back to work. Oh, and thanks to Boyd's hard work on the vegetable garden, we're having fresh soup tonight. Okay, let's get to it. You want to help me and Shell do the supply inspection? Cool. You check the flashlights this time. I'll look over the guns. Uh, no, I don't think so. You just make sure those flashlights are all working. We don't want anyone getting stuck in the dark. Yeah, that would suck. Shell, when you get a sec, meet me out back. Help me feed the watchdogs. Sure thing. Me. He's hungry. Guess he knows it's feeding time. I feel bad for it. Yeah, well, at least we found a way for him to be useful. You know, uh, your sister said she wouldn't mind doing this. Roman, we've talked about this. Becca doesn't need to deal with this kind of thing. Listen, I know you think that giving her an easy life is what's best, but it's really not. This is far from an easy life, Roman. You know what I mean. She needs to know the sacrifices we have to make to survive in this world. As long as she knows how to protect herself, it's fine. I don't want her to stop caring about people. Okay. What's that one eating? I don't know. I'll check it out. I gotta get back out front. Looking forward to that soup. Problem. I do this all the time. You don't get all pissed off. <sighs> you just... You can't go jumping out at people. Not anymore. It's not safe. But... What if I had a weapon? I could have thought you were a walker. What are you talking about? I... <sighs> Look, I... I just saw our walkers out back eating a, a puppy. A puppy? Yeah. I guess it just got to me. You know, it was... It was so little. You don't think about babies anymore, but after a while, you just kind of accept this is it. Yeah. I guess you kind of forget. <laughs> right. 
But then, you know, there it is. You see it and you want to protect it and... And now it's gone. That sucks. Maybe if Clive dies next, we can put him out there instead. He'd make a better watchdog anyway. Becca. Shell! Becca! Something's going on outside! What is it? I don't know. Something bad. We gotta find Roman. Come here, everyone. Shit. Come on, we gotta find Roman. This month. If so, can be fair. Jesus. Largum. My God. Largum. What did you do? All I did was put on the blindfold and bind his wrists. Somebody else beat him up. He already had the cuts and bruises. Watchdogs caught him trying to steal supplies. Is he bitten? No. They didn't get that close. What did he take? Food, medicine, whatever he could get his hands on. Usual stuff. I couldn't get any other information out of him. I don't think he speaks English. I can't believe he just snuck this is in. the second break-in we've had in the last couple of weeks. Last time we couldn't catch him. They got away with more medicine than we could afford to lose. Well, we all know what it's like trying to survive out there. He just came in here for food. Let's just give him some and send him but on his what way. what if there are more of them? He could have been scouting. That's right. He could be part of a larger group. If there were more, I think we would have seen them by now. I mean, nobody travels alone by choice anymore, right? We can't take the risk of letting him go, but why not let him stay? I guess that would be okay. We could always use more hands keeping the place secure. Boyd, we don't need any more people here. And look at him. How is he, he gonna... He can't even speak English. This group works because we know how to communicate. Are you judging him based on race? Of course not. But come on. Well, he's not staying here. You let in a stranger, and everything starts breaking down. The last time we did that, we lost Bree. And then Vernon with that goddamn boat. Vernon and the boat are the reason the group fell apart. Not trusting strangers. I was right there with you when we jumped that woman and her boyfriend for their boat. That was wrong. That's when our group fell apart. He can't stay here. I agree. Keeping him here is not an option. In his condition, he'd be a drain on our resources. Look, we all know what we're talking about here, so let's stop dancing around it. We either let this guy go and take our chances, or we kill him. Jesus Christ! Are you serious? Roman's right. It's gotta be one or the other. We're letting him go. It's the only right thing to do. I'm telling you, we can't do that. But killing him? Is that really the answer? Stephanie, Boyd, you two don't think we should kill him. We know where Joyce and Clive stand on the subject. You're the swing vote here, Shell. What's it gonna be? We have to set him free. We can't. He's not even armed. We can't just kill him. This isn't in self-defense. Isn't it, though? If it means he can't come back to hurt us? That isn't the same thing. But last time... Joyce, that was a long time ago. If we kill this man, then we're giving up a part of ourselves that we can never get back. I'm not ready to let that go. Cut him free. I hope you guys know what you're doing. Oh, Give him have? some food. When, three or four cans. Just as a gesture of good faith. And get him out of here. I don't know if you can understand a word I'm saying. But you better understand this. You came this close to death today. And if you ever, ever come near this place again. Or tell anybody where we are. You'll wish you had died today.
Do you have any fours? Nope. Do you have any sevens? Yep. I miss playing guitar for everyone. It was stupid, but fun. Why don't we do that anymore? Since the attack, there's a lot we don't do anymore. I shouldn't have let that guy go. Boyd would still be alive and everything would be the same. Boyd agreed it was the right thing to do. Anyway, Roman's obsessed with keeping this place secured now. You know that's impossible, right? Well, after last time... Roman isn't taking any chances. Then I should fix the loose board behind the storage lots. Becca, are you sneaking out again? Don't let anyone else know about that spot. Just in case. In case of what? In case something happens and we need to get out of here in a hurry. We've got to always be prepared. Shell, I need to talk to you. It's open. What's going on? Hey, Becca. Hey. When you uh, get a sec, I need you to come out and talk to me. It's important. Okay. I'll be outside. You'll see me. Is this about Becca? Just come see me. What was that all about? Maybe he found out about the boards? Shit. You think so? If he did, I won't say anything. But you better stay away from there for a while. Okay. Stay here. It'll be just a minute. I'll fill you in when I get back. Roman? Good. You're here. What's this all about? It's Stephanie. What happened? We caught her trying to escape. Well, so what, Roman? Ever since the incident, this hasn't been an easy place to live in. If she doesn't want to stay, let her take her chances out there. Well, A, she had most of our seeds, medicine, and ammo with her. And B, you know we can't let anyone leave who knows where we are. She screwed us, Shell. All of us. And now we're in that position again where we can't keep her here and we can't let her go. You do know why I'm telling you this, right? Yeah. You want me to take care of it. You and Boyd were the ones who fought to let that guy go. Convinced us all to take that chance. Well, we did. And it was wrong, and now Boyd is dead. We're beyond the luxury of taking chances now, and I need to know that you're with us a hundred percent. But she's one of us. Th this is different. No, she's not. Not anymore. She tried to sneak out and leave us without any medicine or extra ammo. She knew that could mean the death of any one of us. You got your gun? It's in the camper. I'll give you a few minutes to get your head together. God, what do I tell Becca? That's up to you. Whatever you say, I'll back you up. <sighs> Shell? What's wrong? Am I in trouble? It's Stephanie. She stole a bunch of supplies and tried to escape. Oh my god. What the hell did she do that for? Roman says we have to... Kill her? Yeah. Why would she do this to us? Because this place isn't safe anymore. After those guys attacked us, even after we let their friend go, 
This place just hasn't been the same. Of course not. Roman's trying to make it better. Better? No one is happy anymore. We live like prisoners. But it's safe here. I mean, yeah, I want to get away every now and then, but I would never leave. That's crazy. Roman wants me to do it. I'm sorry. Let's just get it over with. Your gun's over there, in the drawer. You know, we don't have to do this. We can just go. What? We've survived on our own before. If we just go, we can be out of here before anyone can do anything about it. Are you crazy? Where would we go? There's nothing out there. As long as we're here, we're safe. The group will protect us. But for how long? I don't know. Longer than we'd survive out there. Besides, you know the rules. If we try to leave, Roman will hunt us down. We don't have a choice. This is who we are now. I don't want this to be who we are. Just let me do it then. No, I'll do it. You shouldn't ever have to do something like this. I just need a second. This really sucks. Yeah, it does. Shell, it's time. What are you doing? Shell? Shell, what the hell? Sit down, get safe. Shell, hey! Shell, be safe on the planet! What the fuck? God damn it! Okay, got one. A snake for a tongue. You're so bad at this. Would you rather have a snake for a tongue? Awful. Or lobster claws for hands? I swear, this is the worst one ever. You know the rules, miss. Gotta answer. Well... I'm thinking. Think harder. And how exactly do you think harder? Good point. I'll think about that. Neither? That's not really an answer. You don't set the rules around here. Well, that's a fact. Okay. How about... Well, never mind. I probably ought to stop bugging you with stupid hypotheticals. Oh, come on. You'd be a lot less fun. You've been a lot more fun lately. Feeling better? I guess I am. Well, you sure do look better. Well, uh... You gotta admit, anything is an improvement. That came out wrong. Uh, what I mean is... I mean, uh, you were... You were, uh... You know. Take a hike, Big Ears. I resemble that remark. You resemble a satellite. You know, you weren't so damn sassy before. Guess that's a good sign. I mean it, though. After we found you, you were still so hooked on that stuff. Well, I never thought you'd make it. You ain't out of the woods yet, I know, but well, you've come a long way, Bonnie, and I'm proud of you. You're a good friend, Leland. I know. Okay, you're not that great. Look, you know I ain't going nowhere, right? As long as we're together, I'll be there for you. You ain't gotta worry. You know that, right? What are you saying? Bonnie, uh... Leland? Bonnie? D. Hey, honey. I found us something. What are you two up to? Just chatting. Chatting, huh? What about? Oh, uh, well, um, lobsters. Lobsters. 
Well, fishing. Figured it'd be worth a shot. For the food, you know. Leland, you hate fishing. Well, that ain't totally true. And how many days you gone fishing? What? I go fishing all the time. Thought you, didn't I? I am a catch. Don't I know it. I got you a present. Oh, you shouldn't have. What'd you find? I'll tell you later. I don't mean to interrupt your chat with your, uh, girlfriend, but, uh, we gotta get moving. Does she think we... So, where'd you get the bag, Dee? Dee? Dee, did you hear me? What's in the bag, Dee? I told you, it's a surprise. Hey, Dee, when we get back to camp, would you let me borrow some of that nail polish? Sure, hon. You like this color? It's my favorite. And after today, I could use a new coat, you know? Same here. I feel like a drowned rat with these claws. Not to interrupt the girl talk here, but uh, Dee, that, that bag... Look, I found it down the road a piece, all right? Where down the road? Some place off that away. Quit being so cagey about it. Me? Cagey? You two are the ones being cagey. Calm down, Dee. Just tell us where you found the bag. You guys sure gang up on me a lot lately. Honey, that ain't true. Tell me one time you sided with me in the last week. The last month. All right. I can't remember one especially, but I know I have. False. This is how all our fights go. Every time. Now we're standing here in the woods, soaking through, and for what? Don't you want to get to the camp before dark? I ain't the one who stopped. Hush, your voice is but down. But you are the one who made me stop. Irregardless, we could just as easy carry on like this while we're walking. Oh, I've about had it with that attitude. You're going to draw every dead thing from miles around you. Goddamn keep rain on like this. in this goddamn middle of nowhere you did place. That on purpose. You listen to me now. I have had it up I to here with listening to you. To blast. I Leland, that's enough. It's obvious you can't win this one, so why even bother trying? Bonnie, I appreciate you trying to help, but let me handle this, all right? Thank you, Bonnie. Finally, someone makes some damn sense around here. Bonnie, darling, I'm I'm sorry we're Darling. D, come on. Save it. I know what side your bread is buttered on. Yours too. D, now's not the time. What are you saying? You know exactly what I'm saying. Well, come on now, D. No reason to pick a fight. I'm sorry. I just want to get somewhere where I can change my clothes, and then you and your girlfriend can... Oh, shit. Oh, no. Oh, God, run. Come on, we gotta move. What are you talking about? Oh, shit. Stop going so fast! Where are you? I think I saw something over here.
Anything? No, I can't see a damn thing out here. for me. Okay, Bonnie. Stay calm. Find a weapon. for me. Okay, Bonnie. Stay calm. Find a weapon. Bonnie. Killed me. You, you killed me. Anybody see anything? I should it's never have dark out here. trusted you. Just, just a junkie. You're gonna be fine, Dee. You're gonna be fine. Mm, liar. You did this for him. I, I, no. God, I'm sorry. I need him. I need you both. You bitch. Mary, you wanted him. Leland is just a friend. I didn't mean to do this, Dee. I swear to God. You fucking junkie. Spread out. It can't be far. Dee. Dee, did you find her? Honey, I, I thought they got you back there. Jesus, are you shot? God, what happened? Oh, Jesus, oh, Lord, Bonnie, what happened? Oh, my God, Dee. Darling, what happened to you? I, I, I don't know. I, I found her like this. How did this happen? Why didn't you wait for me? Steph, you see something? way! Come on! She deserves a proper burial. We can't just leave her here in a fucking... Cornfield. We can't leave her like this. Help me move her. Bonnie, please. Take a moment and say your piece, but it has to be fast. I'm sorry. Keep moving. You gotta be closing in. Okay. God, okay. But I don't... Got anything to say to her? Leyland, I'm here for you. I loved her, Bonnie. She gets her better than this. I'm sorry to do this to you, darling. I'll leave you here. Call out if you see this him. way. We can't stay here forever. I think I saw something over here. They went this way! What the hell are you doing? 
If she's going to die for this thing, I for damn sure ain't leaving it behind. Hey, you getting up? Good. <clears throat> I should probably hurry. Shit, shit, shit. See anything weird? I'm running my ass off. Bang! I just killed you. You're either stupid as fuck or you think you're tough shit. Or both, I guess. I don't want no trouble. Please. Standing out here like this ain't gonna get you nothing but trouble. Just leave me alone, please. I'm not hurting no one. How do I know that? Maybe you're just walking this highway looking for some tail. You're gonna end up hurting somebody. Maybe killing you right now does our troubled country some good. But honestly, I ain't no do-gooder. I'm gonna let you live. Okay. So you have some balls on you just standing there like that. You get killed eventually. Ain't none of my business. I won't. What's your name? Ruffle. So you didn't steal that bag. I don't care who you steal from, if you did. Maybe you're in a gang that likes to rob people. I don't know. Are you in a crew? You got some boys wearing hoodies I gotta worry about? I'm not in a gang. It's fucking racist, man. Hey, now, I ain't no racist. I just call them like I see them. Just get in the car. You're gonna get eaten out here otherwise, and I'm bored. Come on, scoot. Okay, yeah, I'd like a ride, that'd be good, thanks. Hell yeah, get in, let's tear it up. I'm trying to get to my grand's house. Fuck, she like to party? Just get in, we'll get there, or somewhere, eventually. Name's Nate, by the way. Thanks for asking. You thirsty? Uh... Here you go. I'm straight, thanks. You're not uptight, are you? This is the fucking apocalypse. This is like... nothing. No, I'm just good, alright? Alright, alright. You wanna tell me about where you come from, at least? Must have been with a crew. Any tail back where you come from? Maybe drop you off, do a double back. No, uh, tail. Damn. I retract my question. There was a girl who I liked, all right. You're arguing semantics, Russ. Give a pal the deets. All right. There were seven of us. I didn't have any family there or nothing. They were all at my grand's down in Statesboro. There was a dad who had a daughter about my age. One guy said he used to be a cop, but nobody really believed him. Then a teacher and his wife. The leader was this guy, Steve. Go back to the daughter. Steve was a bad dude, but everybody was with him, you know? 
He said seven was the magic number, so we didn't add nobody to the group. If we found survivors, it was the same every time. He... he... Let it out, Paco. Just... we gonna kill these folks and take this stuff or what? Then bang! They'd be dead. Anyway, I, I couldn't handle that. After weeks of it, I packed my shit up and figured I could make for Grands alone and try to find my family. I slipped out of there. I couldn't live like that. So nobody got down with the daughter then? No, they didn't. What would you give her? Strong six? Just tell me something about her. How was the rack? Give me a little something. Just a taste. Russ, I'm doing you a service here. I gotta get my beak wet. I'll put it right in here. Sure, whatever. Sure, whatever? Come on. All right, maybe someone who wasn't so near and dear to your heart then. What the fuck? Come on, scale it one to ten. What do you think? Ah, slamming before she was gone, right? What do you think? Here, get a look. Fuck! Like a nine, right? Get off me! Maybe you got high standards. Oh, help! If you say five, I'm gonna flip. Tell me, Russ. Ten, okay? Ten, you psycho! Yeah! That's what I'm talking about. Damn it. Would you load that? Bullets in the glove, then. Let's look for some supplies in here. See if we can fill up while we're at it. Don't be mad. Fine, be mad. Just stop being a pussy. Alright. Oh shit! Go! Get out! Russ! Get the fuck down, man! You don't want to be there! Get to the truck! I'll cover you! Okay, get ready! Don't stop running! And keep your head down! Good hustle. What happened to I'll cover you? Look how good you did. All right. What are we gonna do? First, we're gonna figure out exactly where this asshole is. Just get a quick glance. Down! See? Easy. Now we know where he is and we can fucking get him. Alright. Yeah. That's the spirit. Let's push this truck for cover. Okay. It's in neutral. Just keep your head down. Just keep pushing! Shit! Push! Uh, uh, End of the road. What now? We're gonna get around the side of the building. We gotta go from cover to cover. Seriously this time. I'm not fucking around. You gonna cover me? If we get to that car. We'll be out of the line of fire. Here. You can cover me first. I'm not fucking around. You cover me, then I'll cover you. Or if you want to go first, that's fine too. I'll cover you. You go first. Just shoot at the window and keep that bucker's head down till I get where I'm going. Throw me the gun, and I'll do the same. Ready? Yeah. You ready, Russ? Remember, don't stop shooting. Fire! Throw me the gun, and I'll cover you! Go! 
go! Good job! Now what? We get over there and we should be good. Go! my life. Whatever. We got more work to do. Let's see if we can get in around back. Sneak up on this asshole. Follow me. Man, what are we doing? Well, we gotta get in there. Fucker shot at us. Russell, relax, man. When this is over, we're gonna take what we can, head on down to your grams, and have a big old home-cooked meal, all right? Come on. Okay, it's clear. Keep your head down and follow me. You got it. All right. We're gonna be fucking quiet. We're gonna sneak up on this son of a bitch and take him out. You hear me? Not a fucking beep. Let's go. I see him. Check through the window. See if there's anyone else. I think I saw a guy. No shit. Grab him. I'll cover you. Do I sneak up? Or just jump out and grab him? Your call. here you monsters whoa gramps i told you not to come back here think you could just leave your mask at home and now you're with this fucking spook first off watch the fucking racism this is my boy secondly i don't fucking know you we were just passing by like anyone else Bullshit! you came back to finish us off and take all our food you've lost your goddamn marbles she's dying and now she can see your face we've never been here sir then who shot my wife? Wasn't us. You tried to kill us for no goddamn reason. If anything, we should take you out for that. Please just get the fuck out of here. Please leave us alone. What do you say, Russ? Should we just kill these folks and take all their stuff? Uh... Why? All right, look at all this shit. See? Worth dodging some bullets? What the- Relax. You're my boy, Russell. Things are gonna be A-OK. -okay. We were right. There are survivors out here. Still alive? Well, they're gonna be happy to get rescued. So how many are we talking about? Around five, I think. They left a note, so at least we know they want to be found. And I can see smoke in the distance. Probably a camp. I'm gonna try to make contact tonight. Great. Well, just be careful and use your best judgment. Building a good community here, we want to keep it that way. Of course. <laughs> So far, 
are so good. I'm gonna try to talk to him. Wish me luck. Yeah, good luck. Be careful. Don't try to force him into anything. Just get as many of them as you can. You got it. Hey! Don't you- Spit! Don't fucking move! Who the f- I'm a scout for a growing settlement up north. We go out and look for survivors to rescue them. We have food, clean water, and shelter for everyone. We're offering you a chance to help us out and start over. God, this sounds too good to be true, but I think it is. Bonnie, get real. Just because she says it's true doesn't mean it is. You should know about that. Hey, what I told Leland- Cool it. Guys, look. If I learned one thing from Danny, it's that we have to stick together and protect ourselves. What? That guy was an asshole. You should be happy he got killed before Shell and Becca joined us. Why? Don't worry about it. Yeah, screw this. We don't know what kind of people we're dealing with. The only reason I'm with you guys is because Vince saved my life. Look, we need people, plain and simple. You folks can decide if you want to come as a group or split up or whatever. But I don't want to be out here in the open after dark. So in a few minutes, I'm going to be getting back in my car and on my way. Hopefully, at least some of you will follow me. Well, I'm going. Maybe we should go too, sis. If Roman is still looking for us, he wouldn't be able to do anything to us there. There's no way that guy is still looking for you. We've been to that truck stop. There's no one left. Roman's not a problem. It's following her that'll get you killed. Look, I know it's a risk, but what else is there? If you guys are going, then so are we. No, fuck this. She's crazy. I don't trust her. Of course you don't, Russell. You don't trust anyone. I'm not lying to you. How do we know that? You don't. You don't have to come, but we'd be happy to have you. Oh, come on, guys. I mean, we left those photos so that someone could find us, didn't we? Well, it could be a trap. What if they want to kill us? Thank you. Everyone out there is batshit crazy. We've all seen it. Well, we turned out all right, didn't we? You clearly outnumber me. If you wanted to overpower me, you could. Hell, I'll even go along as your hostage until you feel safe. No one is gonna hurt you. That's not a bad idea, actually. And I'll do it. Because I know when you guys see this place, you'll change your minds. Look, I know you guys are wary, and you have every right to be. You don't know me from a hole in the ground. And yeah, there are some crazy fuckers out there. All I'm here to do is make an offer. You can come with me, or you can stay here. The choice is yours. So, who wants to come with me? I'm... I'm just not sure. We've been out here for so long and seen so much bullshit. I mean, is it really worth getting our hopes up? Of course it is, Russell. Hope is all we've got left. But being smart, that's what's keeping us alive. Some of you may have been separated from friends or family. It's a long shot, but there's a chance you could find them there. Have your people been through Statesboro? Yes, I think we have. Okay, but I swear to God, you try anything, you're gonna regret it. Yeah. And if you're not lying, maybe... Maybe Eddie will be there. We'll do everything we can to help you find your friends and family. But understand that I can't promise anything. We understand. I think we've all made up our minds. Well, I guess we have our group. What do you want to do with these? This is a good thing. I know it is. How do we know this will work out? I give you my word. <laughs> 